Hi, the next uh, app I'd like to show you is CyberDuck. Um, now CyberDuck is a FTP file transfer protocol uh, software. It's free, but you can donate, which is an excellent way of um, paying for software which you think you know it's worth it. And um, it helps you and it helps the people that develop these softwares. And um, I think a lot more people buy it because at least you are able to give them what you think it's worth instead of them saying, right, it's going to cost $200. might not be worth $200 to you. So they're going to make a lot more sales this way. But so, yeah, um, this is, like I say, an FTP um, file transfer protocol to download all your files to your website and uh, to any other sites that you, you'll be doing. So uh, it's a lot involved in this one, so I won't go through to it um, at all because um, download it. Uh, if you're into uh, web developing or uh, file transferring, then obviously you will know what it's for, but it's a very good um, free software, basically. My next uh, app is Lil Snitch 2. Very good software, very, very good. Um, and if we go on to here, right, Lil Snitch is <coughs> a firewall protects your computer against unwanted guests. Now, what it means is that when you have programs, what they intend to do, when you open that program, it goes to their server and checks that it's a authenticated, up-to-date uh, bit of software. What Lil Snitch does is prevent that check. And so basically what you can do is download um, software and actually get it to stop from going to its um, service provider and checking that it's an authenticated bit of software. Now when you um, you can get a free download of this <coughs> which is very good uh, but what you'll get in the window up here all the time is that so what you need to do is go onto the settings and actually change that so that it doesn't show up and then all you get is this little bit here and when there's an alert it will show up. <coughs> um, I actually um, paid for this, it cost me I think about £30 um, but if you download the free trial um, what it does every three hours it pops up and you have to reset it and redo it again so within that short time period uh, that then gives the chance for your software to go back to your service provider and check it. But that's uh, Little Snitch 2. If, you have, if you've already got Little Snitch 2, you can upgrade it for $14.95, which mm, I think once you pay for it, you know, really the upgrade should be free, but it, it can save you a lot of money, this program, so uh, check it out. The next app uh, I want to show is ImageWell. Um, it's a small, handy uh, image editing tool, uh, which uh, I don't do a lot of small stuff, so a lot of mine's done with uh, Adobe's. Um, but this might be useful to you. Um, well, to buy it at nineteen ninety five, I. You know, certainly won't pay that, but have a look. It might be useful to you, I don't know. Um, it's not something I'd um, spend money on it, so it's up to you. Have a look. This app's forgot its eye piece. And what this enables you to do is to, <coughs> excuse me, um, is to magnify um, what you're looking at. It's a free download, and so all you do is once you've downloaded it, you click on the icon up here, show magnification, and it will show what you're looking at. 
and what you can also do is have it key uh, sensitive so you can press say like F5 and it will uh, automatically come alight. Uh, so if you've got a presentation that you're doing and you can't really see, um, you can highlight it even better. And uh, okay, not the best of the world, but you know, um, free. That's the main thing. So uh, check it out. Let me know what you think. So we've got this eyepiece, and what this enables you to do is to <coughs> excuse me, um, is to magnify um, what you're looking at. It's a free download. And so all you do is, once you've downloaded it, you click on the icon up here, show magnification, and it will show what you're looking at. And what you can also do is have it key uh, sensitive, so you can press, say like F5, and it will uh, automatically come alight. Uh, so if you've got a presentation that you're doing and you can't really see, um, you can highlight it even better. And uh, okay, not the best of the world, but you know, um, free. That's the main thing. So uh, check it out. Let me know what you think. Next app is called Midnight in the Box, and it's um, one point four. Um, now this software is just open up. It will help you to um, keep all your files in the right place. To um, help you on projects. To you know more really for you know if you're doing a lot of work, a lot of business, a lot of uh, Files for you know school projects, uh, business projects, work-based projects. This will help to <coughs> keep all their files in one place so you don't lose them. Um, it looks quite um, in-depth bit of software, and uh, you can do with dates, months, and everything on it. So it looks pretty good. And uh, if you go to uh, products. Thirty-five dollars. You know, it's up to you whether you think it's worth thirty-five dollars um, <clears throat> for a bit of software that could save you hours and hours and hours. Then, uh, yes, I would think it is. And there's also a free upgrade to, um, excuse me, version two. So at least you won't have to keep paying for upgrades. So for thirty-five dollars, I think it's pretty good software. Uh, but have a have a look and uh, let me know. See what you think.